Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. I've been recording media for quite a few years, uh, longer than many people have even been online. Um, of course, back when I started in the early 90s, um, well, I was really the only person who, who was online, and it was really kind of depressing. Uh, fast forward a few years, and uh, the podcasting revolution takes hold, and, and by this time we had perfected the idea of broadcasting and then recording and uploading um, segments in a time-shifted fashion. People could download, at that point, MP3 files, and I guess podcasting very much to this day is still um, you know, revolving around these common file formats like MP3 uh, for distribution, just because everybody has the ability to play back mp3 audio files. We had a question come in related to podcasting. This was from Marrero, who was in earlier today. And <laughs> Marrero says, I know how to download a podcast and mp3 from a website, but I want something that does it automatically. I wanted to know if Chris would answer me. And just so you know, a podcast is not a media file at all. That's just the name for the method through which you can automatically download a media thing. <laughs> the words are escaping me. So podcasting is the process. A podcast is something that has automatically been downloaded. It's interesting that you would frame, you know how to download a podcast in MP3 because, well, a podcast is an MP3, but an MP3 is not necessarily a podcast. Uh, many people use iTunes. That's what I would recommend outright. Um, you know, quite honestly, I've seen the podcasting software come and go, and the podcasting software would do exactly what you want. It would allow you to go to a website that has a podcast or these series of media files that you may subscribe to that would automatically synchronize either with your desktop computer or uh, a mobile device like an iPod or a PSP. Now the word podcasting, um, most people don't realize it's not uh, based on the word iPod. Uh, P-O-D, when it was originally asserted um, quite a few years ago, uh, before this really was anywhere near where it is today, I believe it was originally uh, an acronym for publishing on demand. And uh, of course, it, as soon as people started getting a hold of it, they thought, well, podcasting must mean that it's for iPods. And no, <laughs> not at all. Uh, a podcast is not just for iPods. A podcast is a media file or a media subscription uh, that uh, once you said, yes, I want to receive any kind of media that this particular publisher is sending down the pike, I, I want to just keep sending it to me and then this software, the podcasting software, will automatically grab the media when new media is uploaded and then, and then synchronize it with either your desktop or in, in some cases and or a uh, mobile device, not necessarily just an iPod. Anything that can play back that particular media file, whether it's an MP3 in the case of audio, uh, or in some cases, MP4, which can be audio and or video. In fact, if you go to our archive for all these videos, we upload the videos to YouTube, but we also publish them on media.perillo.com. Uh, of course, you can also get to that through going uh, to the chrisperilloshow.com or chrisperilloshow.com, which was the classic name for the show. And we haven't really renamed it just because we haven't figured out a, a good name for it. <laughs> I mean, hey, I am Chris Perillo, and I guess this is kind of a, a show. So we upload every video in a format uh, that you can subscribe to in iTunes. You just click the little Add to iTunes button or the RSS button on the uh, the website on media.perillo.com and then choose however you want to subscribe to it and if you already have iTunes installed uh, you can click the button and then it'll pop up in iTunes and be right there so that anytime we upload new videos and we do five short videos a day you will automatically have them downloaded and synchronized with either your iPod your desktop or wherever you choose to synchronize from there but iTunes isn't the only way that you can subscribe to podcasts and certainly uh, the iPod is not the only way you could watch podcasts. Remember, podcasts are not files. That's just the mechanism through which you're able to subscribe to those files. Does that make a little more sense? Hopefully. Don't be so confused. I mean, if, if you're just used to clicking on files on the web, keep clicking on files on the web. If you're looking to have those uh, certain types of media subscriptions, like video subscriptions or uh, 
well, audio subscriptions, then you start using podcasting software like iTunes to automatically grab the latest files and have them synchronized with you know whatever uh, mechanism you normally view media files on or listen to media files in the case of audio files. Uh, hopefully you're not confused of files. Uh, if you files on the files, uh, we'll be in the files, and all you have to files in the files, iTunes files, the podcast files, the files. All right. Uh, well, if you haven't yet subscribed to our podcast or the YouTube channel, by all means, what are you waiting for? Just click the orange button, subscribe either in YouTube or uh, subscribe in the uh, iTunes software that you may already have installed or any other podcasting software. Uh, we're available in a variety of formats, largely video, because that's what makes the most amount of sense. Otherwise, you wouldn't be able to get my wild gesticulations uh, with uh, you know my hands, because I'm Italian, and uh, it just doesn't translate well in audio, and plus sometimes I'll hit the mic and so anyway, leave a comment, follow up. What podcasting software do you use? Do you use iTunes too, or have you moved on beyond iTunes? Do you find uh, other podcasting clients or software to be easier to use? Or maybe uh, you just don't happen to think podcasting is the bee's knees, as many people have come to see. Uh, leave a comment, follow up, whatnot, or swing by the chat room. Let us know what your favorite podcasts are, just media files or well you know we're just all into sharing i you know and people ask me all the time what what my favorite podcast is and uh my answer to that question is yours of course come by the chat room we're always there live.perillo.com